Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover how to solve one-step addition equations. Now, when we solve one-step equations, we want to isolate the variable, which means get it by itself. Basically, we want to undo whatever is being done to the variable. That way, the variable is by itself on one side of the equation. We do this by using the inverse or opposite operation. Keep in mind, it is very important that whatever is done to one side of the equation, it must be done to the other. That keeps everything balanced and equal. Let's jump into number one where we have x plus 16 equals 28. Now we need to isolate that variable of x. We need to figure out what x equals. Since 16 is being added to x, we need to undo that addition by using the inverse operation. So the opposite operation. The opposite of addition is subtraction. So let's subtract 16 from the left side of the equation. Now, whatever we do to one side of the equation, we must do to the other in order to keep it balanced and equal. So let's subtract 16 from the right side as well. Now on the left side of the equation, we are adding 16 and subtracting 16. So these 16s are going to cancel out. They equal zero. So our x is isolated now. It's all by itself. x equals, and then on the right side of the equation, 28 minus 16 equals 12. So x equals 12. That's our solution. Now we can always check a solution by plugging it into the original equation. So let's plug 12 in for x and see if this works. So 12 plus 16 equals 28. 12 plus 16 does equal 28, so we have the correct solution. X equals 12. Let's move on to number two, where we have 57 equals m plus 20. We need to isolate that variable of m. 20 is being added to m, so we need to undo that addition using the inverse operation. The inverse of addition is subtraction, so let's subtract 20 from this side of the equation. Now, whatever we do to one side of the equation, we must do to the other. So let's subtract 20 from this side as well. Now on the right side of the equation, we are adding 20 and subtracting 20. So these 20s cancel out, they equal zero. We are left with our isolated variable of m. So m equals, and then on the left side of the equation, 57 minus 20 equals 37. So m equals 37. And we can rewrite this with the variable coming first. m equals 37. Let's check that solution by plugging 37 in for m in the original equation. So 57 equals 37 plus 20. 37 plus 20 does equal 57, so we have the correct solution. M equals 37. So there you have it. There's how you solve one-step addition equations. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.